Hey, love bugs, it's Ross. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm definitely doing blessed and highly favored, and I sure hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended family, thank you so much for those beautiful vibes that you send me every day, for you opening up your lives and tell me about the light work that you're doing, which is so positive, and y'all keep doing the good work. It's all greatly appreciated. And just thank you for just giving me, you know, beautiful vibes, and you're passing along with other members of the community. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback that you want to give me on my video. Or you just tell me about your empathic gift that has been placed upon you. If you feel like the video has put you in a good place or gave you some good information, go ahead and pass it on. Me a thumbs up, like, and even share. All greatly appreciated. And I hope you're able to get something out of the contents of my video. And thank you so much for stopping by my channel. And the music that I'm listening to today is Sleep Sounds for Physical, Emotional, Spiritual Healing, Sound Bowls, and motion, uh, Ocean Sounds. And I will go ahead and post that link in the description box below. And today my video is about. Twin Flame 101, hey, Oka's tapping into your spiritual and universal laws for help. If it was just like I was reading up on this stuff and I got stuff written down, but the basic laws that we live by, what is it, um, is the laws of life, the laws of creation, the laws of higher awareness, and the, the laws of higher frequency. And they say we take this stuff with us to our next life and our next life and our next life. So, um, and they said, so it's believe, and it, this is crazy, that if, if we're being reincarnated, and we're going to be, we're being reincarnated until all the lessons offered by the divine realm is learned and no mistakes are being repeated. So that could be the reason why we keep living the same thing. We keep going through the same thing. And sometimes we use all these things subconsciously and unconsciously do it. And it's like, you know, we learn things, we, we, we correct them. And it's just, sometimes we go through that rotating door. It's just like, why, you know, I had to cross my eyes on that. Why, <laughs> why I got to go through all this again, but we have to learn things, you know, and they say practice makes perfect. You know, you're going to, you're going to keep having the same mistakes until you learn those lessons. So you can be able to go on to the next step. So it's just like we go through life learning all the mistakes. That we have. That's what we're supposed to do because it's like that's what we were put here to do. We have to learn. We were sent, basically, what did they say? We are sent here to be put in lives. If, if you notice that a lot of us in past, especially hey, Opus, you've probably been placed in a, a family that sometimes can be dysfunctional. You're blessed if you actually have a family that is not mentally and emotionally dysfunctional. <laughs> and it could be physical. But, you know, it's just amazing when I can do research and learn more about things. And it's just like, we signed up for this. Like, before the beginning of time saying, hey, I vow to do. Why the hell did we do that for? But, hey. It's a good thing. It brought back some positive changes. But we took that solid oath saying that we are here da -da 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 -da, to sit up here and do the positive things for the earth and do our contribution as a light worker. But we didn't know all the hell we were going to have to go through for each and every single life that we have to experience. And knowing that it is brought by every change, every pain that we've been through is brought by some kind of lesson and sometimes it's hard to believe that it's brought by something and it's just like you learn from not being taken advantage of you learn self-love you learn self-respect you learn love for others you learn respect for others you learn things on how to live in a positive manner just being the best version of yourself you know helping others allowing people to see the world how it truly is being able to step out the matrix and go 
beyond limited beliefs. You know, that's how we learn. That's how we educate ourselves. That's how we find knowledge is when we push that envelope. We step, step out that comfort zone and get uncomfortable. Get our hands dirty. You know, and it's a blessing to be able to do all those things because it's like, you know, you can be able to tell your story. And somebody can look at life in the most crappiest way. And we do have a bad habit of doing that. And it's just like we might take it in for granted for the things that are placed in our lives. And when we do take those for granted, they get snatched out of our lives. And we have to learn to be able to deal with it. Be able to, you know, just basically rehabilitate ourselves without going without these certain things. Be able to learn, okay, what is this mistake that, you know, I have to learn something. There's something, it's just like we're going through a groundhog day. If you ever seen that movie, with, I think his name is Dan Aykroyd, the guy that, not Dan Aykroyd, I forgot, Bill Murray, off of Groundhog Day, basically Happy Death Day, <laughs> it was like Groundhog Day with a horror movie, you have to keep going through these, you're going to go through the same similar sequence, and it goes on with past lives, you know, past lives, you know, current lives, future lives, but I'm just hoping and praying this is the last time I got to go. Because you get tired of going through the same mistakes. You get tired of going through the same problems. You get tired of being tired. So learn the lessons that the spiritual and universal law gives us. When you need to go for those things, go for your frequency. Go for the awareness. Learn for the creation. Knowing that you, you're able, you're placed here to be a researcher, a teacher, a healer. And knowing these things come by for a positive purpose. And sometimes it can be frustrating. It can be confusing because you don't know where this path is taking you. You might not know what next steps to do. That's when the universe helps you. You ask for it, it comes. Well, usually it does. But it just depends on how what it is. But we all go through life learning lessons and blessings about ourselves each and every day. Learn the lessons that you need to learn so you don't have to keep going down that same path every time. Be able to learn the lessons that you can be able to step on to that next step to get on to the better tomorrows. Learn the things that you need to learn about yourself so you don't have to repeat this life again. <laughs> So, I hope you're able to, you know, get something out of this video. Sorry the, the videos are so short, but I said I'm starting off slow this time. I said usually when I start going all crazy and start making all these crazy videos, <laughs> I get worn out so quick. But I do, I know I forgot to do on my last two videos. Well, I forgot to do um, a rest in peace to Miss Aretha Franklin, the Queen of Soul. You know, I don't know if all you guys listen to her, but I know a lot of people, especially, you know, people I grew up with, all different walks of life, has learned something off Miss Aretha's music. You know, probably sung it. You know, your parents probably listened to it. I grew up listening to her music, the gospel music. Um, a lot of just the R&B soul, you know, and it's just like God has really earned a, a lovely angel today. So it's just like I'm probably doing like four or five videos in one day. So when you're seeing this on Friday, I know you're like, Rosalind, she died like two days ago. I know, but I'm actually doing it on the day that she passed. So, you know, just keep, keep her family in your prayers. I think she died from some kind of cancer. So um, it was really hard to listen to today but you know I know she's just in a better place so I hope you are able to get something out of my message um, like and subscribe you can hit the notification bell so you know I'm about to upload my next video drop me a line or two I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me and send out as much light love and light and positivity as you possibly can know that you are loved and blessed and highly favored and know that there's also somebody out there praying for your better days so i will see you on my next video and peace and be wild and have some fun this weekend bye